over. Please hurry, install the crystal creature. Oh, these were the last the two. Drunk abstainer's eyes. I'm oh, we might actually drunk, be beating the game sooner than I thought. Let's go. They are iced out. That feels better. We are three. If only we could be four. Uh, all right. So, so what, what? What do you want us to do? To, to you know, to help you get to be four. What, what do, do you think, Dum Dum? You have to find two more of the crystal creatures. And then somehow get them plugged into Glorcon's eye holes. Oh that would gosh. Be nice to four of us who will once again be back normal and the, the whole thing, the reunited thing that we talked about earlier in the game. Alright, okay, we're gonna head out. Good, head out. And as Let's you look back to the telepod, we'll just go ahead and let you know that, you know, we don't know what's going on. You know, our brains are what? all a amok. You know, it's all muddied. We can't really predict the future of anything right now because Glorcon's out there changing the present. You know, he's doing things and we don't know what the hell those <laughs> the rippling effects are. We don't even know what he's up to. Chair Orpian, you doing, you feeling pretty good? You doing okay? Suck your mother. All right, good. That's good. That's good to hear. I'm happy to hear that you're feeling good. All right, get out there and we're getting close. We're getting close to the final part of this whole thing. Boss, I'm feeling a little weird right now because we just found out Glorcon's motivation is just true love. Oh, oh that makes you feel weird, does it? Does that make <laughs> you feel weird, Chair Orpian? Uh... No. Yeah, I didn't think it was relatable. Who's ever... Love is a joke anyways. No one's ever felt real love. That's that's a sign of a sociopath lunatic. Why well, shut up. feel love. Oh, relatable, my shoe. You two get out of there, get out of here and go talk to Ch uh, uh, George. You're a bunch of do doofuses. Go, get your work done. George, you. go talk to him. Take the telepod there. Hurry up. Get a hustle on. Yeah, you won't let me choose. I'm trying. What the? Oh, hey. What's going on? I'm bathtub guy. Oh, shit. Oh, I I'm so sorry. We're in a wrong spot, Partner, bro. I, I don't think this is George. Uh, the telepod might have misfired. Oh, yes, I'm George, but when I'm in the bathroom, people call me bathtub guy. <laughs> you guys need to play a little midnight shuffle? I mean, listen, we do hey. have big stuff to do, but... He's talking to Tunes on, didn't he? Uh, maybe? What's midnight shuffle? You know midnight shuffle. It's when two consensual adults tuck in their chub, hop in a tub, and sit knee to knee. He yeah, got, a, I, no, he got the dryer right there. He's gonna get electrocuted, ain't he? Feels good. We're gonna no, end up killing this man. I'm gonna be at a birthday party in about an hour, but if we hurry, I'm sure we can get it done. All right, look, hey, listen, we're not here for some midnight shuffle, okay? <laughs> we're gonna end up Our killing this man. Hey, this is porcelain, bitch. Don't hit oh. this. <laughs> Shit, look, I'm sorry, man. Okay, 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 right. So. What I was saying was, <laughs> I know boss, that SOB owes me 13 space dollars and 15 space hairs. <laughs> he came over one time for a little. Hey, can you chill out on the jumping? I'm trying to tell a story, goddammit. Okay, cool. Look at so, the shower curtain. He came over one time for a little cream dream action. I That's what you do. Turn up the AC crazy. Really high, then sit in the bathtub full of cream corn and scream the ever loving ass off. Ooh! Way is fun. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, twelve days go by and we finally get out of the tub, right? I mean, look at our bodies were all pruny. My fingers were so <laughs> tiny I wanted to touch them. And just as he's about to leave, I go, "Hey, man, that'll be thirteen space dinero." And he's like, "Thirteen what?" Then all of a sudden, boss takes off running. Now I don't know if you know this or not. But boss is as agile as a greased baby going down a water slide. So the only way I'm going to catch him is if I pull out my hookah kooky and give him a whirl of pearly. What is so this man talking I about? I mean, that in real estate, of course. I've been selling a lot of real estate in Manhattan lately, so that's been working out. But property values are going up the roof. <laughs> so it's hard to find clients what is this who man actually going want to invest about? into a property. But I always try to tell them, invest early. Because if you don't, you'll be caught in a snowstorm later wishing you had. You don't want to be stuck in an apartment paying $4,000 worth of rent when you could have bought a place on 34th Street Preach. for less than that, do you? Preach, Two brother. years down the line, you won't even think about it. But my mother always says, bathtub guy, shut up about real estate. <laughs> nah, bathtub guy <laughs> speaking facts, keep though. on talking about it because it's a great investment if you want to make something out of your life. Another great investment, ice cream on Sundays. Trust me, ice cream on Sundays will make you feel closer Bruh. to God. 
Do I come to your home and hit you when you in your tub? Crap. Seriously, have I? Because that would be rude. Don't do it to me. Partner, would you just listen to him? Okay, cool. So, oh my gosh. I'm a Christian man, but I don't necessarily believe in Christianity. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> you know, my mother certainly says it is. But I don't let that stop me from getting out and preaching half This man of is just talking, now, I'll bro. grab a Bible, tear out half of it, and then just live talking. by that part of the Bible. Old Testament, New Testament, no clue. I just point to a page and I go. A lot of times that ends up being revelations. So I tell people, hey, if it's the end of the world, might as well get into real estate. <laughs> hey, listen. Hey, sorry. Pat, bathtub guy. George, whatever. The world is at stake. Can you just hand over the crystal babies, please? Oh, no, I'm sorry. I didn't realize I was being such a nuisance to my two uninvited guests. Look, I'm sorry. We're not trying hey, to be an asshole. Relax. Oh, you don't need to try. It just comes natural to you. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> so, your sorry's in a sack. Well, I don't got them. They're on loan to Tech World. Oh, hey, uh, shit, I know where Tech World is. Fucking Tech World, man. Great. Now, let's see if you know where the door is. That means leave, asshole. Shut you up. You two turd birds come barging into my place uninvited, telling me to be quiet. Shut I'm up. Just trying to see. Oh, money wow, partner, would you take a look at this cool tech world, Let's this go. gear world? Man, this is going to be a fun one to a... It looks like they're trapped in some force fields inside of a weird mech machine. Let's go get them. Oh, yeah, they're right there. Surely it ain't going to be that easy. Oh, crap. These guys again? Mm. Get them. You guys are fucking dead, yo. I ain't nothing. I'm a money man. Woo! Hey, what the fuck? Get out of here. Slap up. Oh, shoot. Oh, look who it is. It's stuck face and shit. Oh, my gosh. They deep. This time, we're not fucking around. Yeah, that's right. We're gonna fucking murder you. You ain't gonna do nothing. I am telling you. I'm gonna fuck you up, punk. Y'all ain't about it. Y'all ain't about it. Mm-hmm, get off the board. Get off the board. Ah. Oh, so you wanna put your hands on me. You wanna, get off my board. Man, those Gloricon clones, bunch of idiots. Uh, no idea how they keep popping up wherever whoa, we are. Whoa, these gears. Whoa, we're on the gears. No uh, time to soak in the landscape. We gotta get these, these crystal creatures and then figure out a way how to get them into Glorcon's eyes. Uh, I'm not exactly sure which way I should be going. Oh, whoa, whoa, we're on the gears. Oh, jeez. There we go. Go this way. I don't know what's over there, but let's just go this way. Let's get these crystal creatures and oh great here we go thought they were gonna fucking get to the bottom of this not on our <laughs> shut up you get to the bottom of the level how about that get off of this get out of here god i almost feel kind of bad for these guys nah i don't feel bad for them they deserve to die we got work to do my brother All right, look what I see. A couple of the. A it's too of, easy. Holy shit! Partner, we gotta grab the crystal babies. They're, they're down over by the telepod. We gotta get them and let's get the hell out of here. It's all same, right? Huh, bring me over there. Oh! <laughs> Surprised? It's me. That's get up! Right. I, you played yeah, right in my hands. You're a couple of fucking idiots. Oh my god! All I planted in your telepod was never intended to kill you or the abstainers. I wanted you to merge the abstainers. You want to know why? No. Because of this. With this device, I'm going to be able to merge a bunch of worlds using the, oh, train, the power of the abstainers. Now with the crystal babies, get up, device, They're connected to the other three abstainers. Here we go. Oh, look at my shadow. It's the Big Bang Attack, Vegeta! <laughs> it worked! And this is oh. just the start. A small machine and just a handful of worlds. 
My next machine is going to include the power of your dogs. And it's going to merge 87 Get my dogs, dogs down to five massive ones all in one fell swoop. Unfortunately, it's going to kill the other three abstainers as well as Get your my dogs, dogs in the process. What a shame. Oh, what a shame. Too bad you're trapped here with no way out, no food, no water, no telepod. All according to plan. And now that everything's all jumbled up, no one's going to be able to help find you. Good luck, you shit fucks. Suck my little balls. <laughs> Trover, get up, man. Oh, God. We got work to do, dog. Jeez, partner. Now we're trapped with no place to go. We're basically... Like Tom Hanks and Castaway. Nah. Oh, we're gonna have to live the rest of our lives here. Nah, we're good. I mean, this is it. Glorcon won. This Get in that horrible. hole. I mean, oh, I guess know, we can't. gotta focus on survival now. We got, we, we gotta just let everything. Forget about the dogs. Forget about you know trying to stop. Oh, Glorcon. that's our shit. It's Tom Hanks style now from Castaway. Ever see that movie? I mean, you should check it out real quick. And then come back, so we we're gonna have to deal with this. I mean, this we're, we gotta start figuring out where we're gonna get food. We we should start trying to build shelter. What the? Holy shit! Wait, hold, hold on. Oh, here we go. Hello, excuse me. We need some help here. What the? Hey, hey uh, what's what's going on? Boss sent me out here. Said there was some commotion going on, so I uh, came in my uh, Z telepod. Have you heard of one of those? Of course you haven't. It's my fucking telepod. It's trouble point up. I just cleaned it outside, inside. I fucking love that telepod. Uh, it's just over there. The commotion you're talking about is just right around the corner. All right, cool. I'm going to solve this mystery. I'm going to get to the bottom of this. I'm Pink Trover. There's going to be a whole spinoff of Pink Trover. I got a story, too. I'm Pink. I'm awesome. And I'm going to figure this shit out. Nobody's going to fuck with me. I'm Pink Trover. Pink Trover. Pink Trover in a half. version of me. Pink Trover in a half. Has a fucking telepod. Pink Trover in a half. Turn around the corner. Let's go. Hurry. It's our only way out of here. Pink Trover in a half. Pink Trover in a half. Pink Trover in a half. Oh my god, that poor Pink Trover. What an idiot. What a dummy. Holy shit. This might be a trap. So wow, this is a really nice fancy telepod. I mean, it's better than that garbage we've been using this whole time. I mean, it's got different. It's different colors. It looks exactly the same. This is a T8000 model. Wow. It's got all kinds of doodads in here. I mean, it looks pretty much the same. But, Lethal I mean, huggers too. Doodads in it. I'll hug you to death. Play up.